hello everybody welcome back to the channel today I'm gonna show you how you can create dynamic labels for your excel charts the trick is very very simple so please stick with me till the end and before we start please if you're not subscribed please do subscribe to the channel 98% of our viewers are not subscribed so thank you very much and let's begin so before I start showing how to do it I would like to give you a demo for example I have this data set with this chart and the slicer if I select any item on this slicer you will notice this title is going to change automatically you see this is basically what I'm gonna show you today how you can achieve this so let's begin I have this demo data set which is in a pivot table format but it can be in any format as long as it has a slicer it will work okay so I'm gonna insert the chart and I'm gonna hide all these buttons I don't like it and then I'm gonna insert a slicer in here you can insert the slicer from here or wherever you like okay we go the slicer now we're gonna activate the title for this chart so click on the chart click on this plus menu and click on chart title by default you see when you click on the city the chart title doesn't update because it's fixed to make it dynamic there are two ways if you just want your selection name over here what you can do you can select the title and the for select the formula bar and do equal and reference this the first cell from your data set and that's fine and every time you're gonna change the slicer the title will update automatically however if you would like to add something else after this city or before it you have to do a little different trick to achieve it so basically if I try to add a raw data here basically a string you see it won't work yeah Excel doesn't allow you to do that so we need to bypass this and the trick is very simple basically so just pick up any cell you reference that cell your selection cell and then here you can do whatever you like so let's say I would like to put uh, year 2024 you can do and oops uh, doo -doo. so you can do and and you can type whatever you like basically this is a raw data raw string and here you go and then you can reference the title to this cell let's see basically this is how you can achieve this and you can hide it wherever you like behind the chart or wherever you like yeah that was the trick done guys thank you very much for watching please again if you're not subscribed please do subscribe to watch more content like this and see you in the next one